think so, no. It's just a, it's a chemistry. Mm. It's, you know, it's a, it just happens or it doesn't. I mean, it's not that different than, you know, meeting somebody for the first time and really liking them mm -hmm. or meeting them and really just not being very interested. Mm -hmm. You know, the people that really like each other pretty much remain friends for a long time. Mm -hmm. The people that don't make an a, effect on you, right. you kind of forget yeah. immediately. Uh -huh. So it's, uh, again, it's rather intuitional, I think. So throughout the years, um, which would be like, I'm sure it would be very difficult to choose, but, but um, like, which would be like your favorite track of Fleetwood Mac individually? That's a very hard question to answer yeah. because <clears throat> um, at certain times, you know, when you're right in the middle of an album, mm -hmm. probably one of those songs is going to be your favorite song. Mm -hmm. um, if you're going to look back over mm -hmm. 15 years, you know, for me, the only example I could say is that I still really enjoy singing Dreams and I've been singing it every mm -hmm. night for a long, mm -hmm. long time. Mm -hmm. And, you know, it, mm -hmm. I just, it just brings back the memories of when we did it every time I, I sing it. Mm -hmm. So I would say, you know, I really love that song. Mm -hmm. But that doesn't mean that it's the most important song of all, out of all mm -hmm. the songs that we've done. So it's just up to you, really, mm -hmm. 